Damn it. Okay, Damn let's it. run. Before it derails. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Alright, we're gonna, um... I'm dead. I am. <laughs> oh. But we got it. We got it. It worked. It worked. Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Cypher's Game War for Everything. That's right, we're checking out everyone's favorite Polish Bolshevik war game created by the Polish government. We're going to be checking out Tunnel here, so let's go ahead and click on that so that starts to load. My name is Sergeant Major Stefan Kajderowicz, and I will most likely die in a few moments. What am I saying? I'm going to die. That's for sure. And on my own accord. The boys from the 12th, the Podolian Uland Regiment, have already destroyed the bridges on the Molyanka River. So Groja and number 56 Komunar cannot return to Korostan. One of our boys has picked up the routes of armored trains. Hell knows how. The recon team boys have chosen a spot, marked it, and left the tools on site. Someone came up with the great idea for someone to get in there, do the job and run easy, theoretically. So what does Kajerovic do? A volunteer. What was I thinking? Well, that's done. Now the honor of the 2nd Rokitian Chevaux Leger Regiment lies in my hands. Find the markings, unscrew the railway tracks, and run. Come what may. All right, looks like we're going to go derail a train. Okay, find a way into the Oh, do you guys see what I see? Right there. Got ourselves a tripwire. Let's uh, let's not blow ourselves up here. We'll start by disabling that. If you haven't checked out, you that could have killed me. If you haven't checked out any of the previous episodes of Cipher's Game War for Everything, go ahead and go check that out in the other videos. The first one, we uh, were in a radio station deciphering the, the Bolshevik codes, and then the second one, we broke into a train yard and stole some documents out. And now it looks like we're about to go derail one of those trains. So let's go ahead and pick this lock here. Uh, if you remember from the previous video, these are not the easiest locks to pick. They uh, are very finicky. You know, you almost have to have it spot on there. We broke that pick. You know, Skyrim S type lock picking. Okay, so we got through the gate and into the dark, scary tunnel we go. And we are immediately faced by a, get there? a giant wall. Can we jump up it? No. Um, okay, let's. I don't see anything here. I bet you there's something out here we can grab. Yeah. Can I grab one of these sticks? No, maybe one of the boards. Hmm, no, nope, none of that. How about this iron rot fence, fence, iron rot, whatever, iron rot fence, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, oh, there's a ladder right here. Let's go ahead and pick the ladder up. Grab that. This will come in handy. All right, and we'll go, uh, oops, caught on the door there. And voila. All right, up the ladder we go. Let's hope it can hold my weight. To the tippy top. It seems like it held your weight. We didn't go for a, a tumble or anything like that, my friend. Okay, now down the dark, creepy sewer pipe. See what awaits us. I hear some running water, I think. Something. All right, into now? here. Um, do we go left or do we go right? Let's go left and see what this. Uh, I'm assuming this is like a sewer? This has got to be a sewer. All right, I see some stuff this way. Let's. Uh, you could fit the entire horse army of Bajoni in these tunnels. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got over here. We got a map we can take a peek at. All right, so it looks like we came in at that left circle. Um, yeah, let's go. I guess let's keep going this way. Let's see what we can find. A way around them. Way around what? There's a door down there. Let's see if we can get to that door. There's a tunnel that way. Wheelbarrow. Let's bypass this. All right, let's go all. Oops, cut on something there. Let's go all the way down here, see what we can find. Game saved. Down into the creepy dark tunnel. Another door to lock here, or excuse me, unlock. There we go, nice. We got that picked. Oop, another tripwire. Okay, so we gotta be on the lookout for these tripwires because they will go boom. And we don't want to do that now, do we? Alright, all the way down here. Ooh, this is different. Uh, water pipe there. 
I don't know what we got. Some Something here might come in handy. Chains. Yeah. Well, okay. What's the thing that might come in handy? So I'm guessing it's over on that table. Let's just check all this stuff out. Nothing over here. All right. Let's pop across these boards. Up. Oh. Um. What is this? This will come in handy. Shaft for drainage mechanism. Okay, so what are we draining? I don't see anything there. Anything down here? Axe? Can we grab the axe? No. Nothing over here. Fine. Okay, so we had to come down here and get what we needed to get. Let's head back up. This appears to be a somewhat of a dead end. Alright, we'll keep running here. Up the stairs. So if you've been enjoying this game, let me know in the comments down below what you think of it. It's, uh, you know, it's a free game, so keep that in mind. Again, created by the Polish government to tell the story of the Polish Bolshevik War and the efforts the, the Polish soldiers went through uh, to, to win the war um, and not lose to the, to the Bolsheviks. All right, we're going to jump down here and head this way. You know, for, for a free game, I think it's pretty good. Mine? Here? The only thing I don't like is sometimes the directions can be be a little hard to follow or understand and do exactly what it's wanting you to do. Uh, it could be a little more well-worded sometimes. I hear a bat, maybe? I don't know. Okay, we're into the mine now, deep into the mine. Are they mining gold? Do you like me some gold? Um, let's go, let's go right, shall we? Yeah, let's go this way. See what we can find. Oh, we gotta crawl through here, it looks like. Alright, down we go. Bippity bop. Ooh, is that a rat? Something's making some noise. Okay, we'll keep going this way. Another tunnel to crawl through. It's kinda creepy. I, I would be claustrophobic. I don't know if I could do this. All is darkness, all is quiet. <laughs> Indeed, and just cramped. I uh, couldn't, yeah, I couldn't crawl through that. I've gone caving once, I think. No, twice maybe. Uh, and I remember there was this one place they called it the uh, the Nutcracker. You're in a, a little tunnel about the size of a, a body, and um, oh, okay, we're in a little Seems flooded like room. Way is down. Okay, so we got to drain completely flooded. Drain that water, I'd imagine. That's what this drainage thing is for over here. Um, anyways, Nutcracker in this really small tunnel about the size of a person, and. Uh, Something is missing here. All right, so we got to get this. Something is missing here. That's busted. Okay, let's take the wheel off this. It's <laughs> like a valve opening mechanism. Keep getting distracted by the game. Um, like nutcracker, small tunnel, not fun. Basically, the the summation of this story. Okay, let's go ahead and drain the water here. Get this bad boy spinning. Okay, we got ourselves an A D A D. Spin here we go. A should be D. Oh, A again. Okay, they changed it up on us. Ooh, a W. They really changed it up. Sounds like the water's draining behind us. Nice. Okay, all that water is draining. We'll back out of here. Bada bing, bada boom. And just like that, we can pop on down. It right. worked. It did work. Good job, us. Alright, and then through this door, I'm assuming. Yeah, there's nothing behind us. Okay. Through the door. Um into what was a flooded mine shaft? I don't know, why would they... That doesn't make sense, unless there's like a spring there and that's why they have it blocked off. Um, okay, that's all. So we came down this way. Oh, okay, this way. Let's go this way. This looks more like our path. Do we need to crouch here? There is no way I could squeeze nope. through here. Nope, okay. Well, <laughs> you tried, my friend. You tried. Okay, let's go this way then. Oop, another small... Hmm. Small spaces. I have to crouch. Indeed, you do. All right, Looks and like popped found a way out the guards. we go. Okay, so around the guards, probably should turn our flashlight off, uh, and let's keep Assassin's Creeding it, just like the last episode. That guy's over there, so it looks like we need to sneak behind him here on this board. Okay, let's pop down like that. Strong enough. Well, we got. <laughs> we're going one way, or we're falling in the water. I'm assuming we pop in this sewer pipe here. Nice. Okay. Around that debris there, through the sewer pipe. Flashlight back off. Almost there. All right, good job, us. I see a guard over there. Let's get up top here. See what we can see. 
Okay, so do we gotta go right behind him? Oh, there's a sewer pipe right there, okay. Let's go nice and quiet over this boardwalk here. I don't know if they're blind or not. Oh, he's kind of stumbling. Is he drunk or sleepy? I don't know, whatever. I'll take the advantage of it. All right, so we're gonna pop through the sewer pipe on the left here. We could try to sneak behind him probably. I think he's that inebriated. All right, into this tunnel. We'll run through here, pop out. I'm assuming this is a dead end. Yeah, anything here? Ooh, there's a card we can take, nice. The water dam on Sola in Probikia. Oops, let's turn our flashlight off. He's looking right at us. Go away, dude. There you go. All right, let's get past this guy as quick as we can. All right, he's over there now, nice. Um, I'm assuming we gotta pop down here into the water. Big old splash. Okay, um, let's go up this staircase here, because it looks like we have to go this way. Do, 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 up to the tippy top. Uh, there's a crane or something over there. There's a guard on that walkway. Uh, looks like, okay, I bet you we have to go down through there. And crouch through here. All right, this is uh, a little stressful. Not as fun as Assassin's Creed can be, where you're jumping over everything and sword fighting 50 people. All right, and we're through that. Let's walk down all this. Boop, 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 boop. Into the water here. Making a hell of a lot of noise, but you know, they are ignoring us and I'll, I'll take that as a win. All right, we'll sneak around this corner here. Hi, dude. Yeah, you just keep looking at that wall, not really guarding. I don't know what you're guarding. It looks like it's a dead end in there. So anyways, we're just gonna walk on past this guy into this tunnel system here. Still fulfilling our objective of not getting caught. So, you know, got that for us. Okay, that looks like that's locked. Turn this back off. Okay. Oh, there's someone right there. Let's back up for a second. Let him do his thing. Uh, I don't see anything on either side immediately, so we probably have to like sneak underneath him. All right, let's, let's go nice and slow here. Okay, I think what we'll do is get underneath him. Once he turns, we'll pop into one of these culverts, let him go around, and then um, we'll keep going. Okay, so he's turning around. We're gonna pop underneath him. Hi, my dude. Yeah, you keep walking. You and your blurry face that I really can't see that well. Okay, he's over top of us. We'll sneak around this way. We should probably like walk backwards so we can see when he turns around. But we should be good. Uh, now we just gotta figure out a way out. Um, some st oh, there's the stairs, okay. Let's pop up these stairs here. Hopefully he doesn't see us. Voila. Okay, there's a guy there. He's still there. We'll let him turn around, then we'll cross this little bridge here. Okay, turn around, my dude. You and your, like, greenish-brownish uniform and lamp and whatever that is. Okay, he's turned around. We'll start to sneak across this way. Um, probably making a lot of noise on the metal, but I don't think they're that good of guards. He's just over there enjoying a cig. Smoking kills. Okay, so we've made it past those guys. Uh, looks like we need to go down here. Down here. Okay, there's that guy there. Down one more. Oops, we gotta jump over this, I guess. Alright, let's crouch again. Turn our flashlight back off, because we really don't need that on. Alright, and then, okay, looks like we gotta sneak around in the shadows here. We'll hug the wall. So this guy over here, who's also smoking, doesn't see us. Let's pop this way. Hug the wall as we splishy splash our way through. We'll look right at him menacingly. You know, maybe if he looks at us and finds us, we'll, we'll roll intimidation and he won't even respond. Okay, through all that, hug this wall, pop out here. Guessing we don't want to climb this. Uh, what do we got here? Can we go underneath this guy? Looks like we can go underneath this guy. If we just go nice and slow and quiet like. He's looking straight out. Don't look down, my dude. Keep looking that way. Pop back in here, very nice. Okay, looks like we're heading over to that board there to get up and out. Once we get a little bit of distance from this guy, we'll uh, pop on up. We'll get to this metal or this concrete here and we should be good. Okay, nice. All right, sneaking past these uh, Bolshevik guards and we're doing it well. Might have wet shoes, but that's okay. 
All in the name of winning the war. Okay. Still not seeing anyone. That guy's over there. So we probably should move a little quicker. Oop, culvert here. Oop, that one's closed. Okay, so we're not going through there. Let him do his thing. It must just be really, really dark in here if he's unable to see us. That guy's there. We can crouch behind here, it looks like. All right. And then I see a door down there. I wonder if that's that guy's just looking right at it. Them somehow. Yeah. Okay, I wonder if we can drop all this metal here. So let's go here, go here. Is there a way to distract them somehow? There will be. Give me a second, my dude. All right. Pop up through here. Oops. Man, these uh, spiral stairs are not the easiest to climb. Turn that off. So my guess is we drop guess that, guess junk down and then there. we'll pop through there and go through that door. No, it didn't go. There it goes. Boom. Making hell of a noise. Alright, they're going that way. Turn our flashlight on so I can freaking see this door. Oops, that made a lot of noise. Oh, lock it. Haha. Uh -huh. Sucks to suck, my friends. Sucks to suck. Okay, we'll let them fiddle with that for a little bit. This wall looks fresh. I guess I could blow it up. How? I don't have any dynamite, do I? Did I bring dynamite with me? The grenade will fit right in. What grenade? Did I Should grab we a grenade? See if it works? Well, I think that's gonna go boom. Boom, okay, nice. Man, I'm gonna imagine our eardrums would be popped. There's like no way for that sound to escape. Can we go through this? Let's see if we can crouch through here really quick. I know we just blew that up. Nope, okay. Swing around here before they open that door. Ooh, we caused a fire. What did they store in here? Some wire cutters. We'll take if they those. Use this for cutting their toenails. <laughs> All right, and we'll uh, go through this door here. I need to like, cut the chain. Chain that. Clip the clap. All That's right. Good. Already. Where is that damn wrench? There's the wrench. Now, now let's find the mark. Do. Turn our flashlight on. It's got to be right around. Oh, there's the mark. Okay, nice. And we'll take these screws out. I'm not gonna make it. Oh, I can hear it. Okay, Bloody come on, we gotta hell. go quick. Come on, come on, come on. Too slow. I no, we're not. We got faster. this. We got this. Damn it. Okay, Damn let's it. run. Before it derails. Go, 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 go. Alright, we're gonna um I'm dead. I am. <laughs> oh. But we got it. We got it. It worked. It worked. Nice, and we outran the train successfully. Sucks to suck there, train. Uh, not as fun as I thought it'd be. Historians are still discussing the significance of Polish radio intelligence during the Polish-Bolshevik War. We do know that breaking over 100 encryption keys and intercepting more than 4,000 Soviet ciphertexts have been the most heavily guarded secrets of the Polish armed forces. To what extent did this contribute to the winning of the war? Would the miracle on the Vistula have been possible without the talent and determination of officers serving in the Cypher Bureau, together with cooperating mathematicians from the universities of Warsaw, Krakow and Lviv? For decades, the achievements of Polish Special Forces has been kept secret. Today we know clearly that this was the beginning of cooperation, which led to one of the greatest successes of the history of Polish intelligence the breaking of machine cipher keys of the German Enigma. In 1922, Jan Kowalewski was awarded a silver cross of the Virtuti Militari Order. During the decoration ceremony, General Władysław Sikorski said, this one is for winning a war, Captain.
Alrighty, well that's Cypher's Game War for everything. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a comment on down below. Let me know what you liked, you didn't like. Always looking for feedback for improvement on my commentary, audio quality, video quality, anything like that. Uh, I'd really appreciate it. If you really enjoyed the content, don't forget to like and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. If not, we'll see you in the next video.